had somebody requesting I'd make a little update video on my Chevy. I got rid of my Chevy, but my GMC also 5.3. I'm assuming the battery is the same. I mean, it's in the same spot. I don't know. I ain't really mess with it. But I'll just show you the same thing. I'm gonna stand on my tire right here. Tuck my chain in. I'm gonna scratch up the new truck. It's the baby. Upgraded from the Chevy. Got the GMC. I mean, if you guys follow the YouTube, you know I got the new house and shit. But let me show you. Let me show you, man. I'm up on my tire. I get the negative cable and I just follow it down. And I see where it goes. They both, it's two wires. They both, let me get this GoPro over here. They both be going down. Sorry, my engine's hot. I just got home. And they shoot all the way down. So then what I would do is jump over here. And in the, in the Chevy, I didn't have all this fender liner and all this nonsense. But if you look, look right there, I could already see it, man. I could already see it. There's one ground wire right there. And hey, start my truck and turn the wheel all the way to the right. Hold on, man. Let me try to get you a better shot of this. And this is passenger side. And that's the one that fixed it. My bad. To the left. All right, you can turn it off. Man, this shit's dirty, man. We've been having snow, all other kinds of shit. You can see that right there. Ground wire. It's about the same location on the Chevy, I ain't gonna lie. And you can see all that crud. Look at all that crud. That is, look at that. That, what, that's what I was talking about. That is what made mine do it. It's not loose, it's on there. I took it off. I got a, I think I use purple power, but I mean soapy water, anything, man. Get you a wet rag, some soapy water. Scrub the whole shit up. From the factory, they put that grease, that dialectic grease, so it doesn't get corrosion and it doesn't lose contact on those bolts. I took the whole bolt out. I cleaned the whole wire, the whole ground connector. I cleaned the, the body itself, the frame. I cleaned it real good. I put it back tight. No issues after that. No issues. For me, it was this wire. Let me see if I can see up in there. I'm up under here and see where the other ground wire goes. So you can see, you can see the bundle. It comes down right there. The two wires, they come from the top, the ground. One of them is this one. And the other one goes that way. And I want to say that other one is the one that's on the side of your block. I want to find it for you though. Let me see. And I did check them all. I checked them all. But I even popped the whole top of my dash off on the Chevy. You seen it in the video. Because people say that the insulation gets gets up under there. I want to find that boat. Oh man, I can see it, but it's a bitch to see. Let me see if you can see that. If not, I must have shoved my GoPro up in there. I might even scratch the lens. Let's see. Yeah, you see it. I see it on the GoPro right above my fingertip right there. It's on the side of the block. Let me see if I can get it from up here. This has got the pearl paint. I ain't trying to scratch it up, but I will help you out, my man. And it's hard to see from up here. Let's see. Because it wraps around. And it comes back. This is way too high. The access point. But I mean, I could see it. I could see where it goes. Let's see if I can angle my GoPro right. That wire right there, you see it running? It's got like a silver connector on the end over there. Right there. That ground wire goes straight into the side of the block. That one and this little one. I'm pretty sure, man. You, you clean that. Clean that up. Put it back. If you still have the issues, then it it's not a ground issue. You gotta you gotta clean that contact spot real good. And if it's not that one, it's a little guy. If you ain't got this liner, man, you could get to it so easy. I can see it. That little bolt right there, right above my finger. The ground. You check both of them. Make sure your battery's charged. Even if it starts your truck, no problem. I had a, a comment. They they said that uh, the low battery, man, the low battery will do it to you. And it's weird. I had no idea. I don't know. I, I, I 
had no issues with the Chevy, but this was the truck I wanted when I bought the Chevy. It's just, I got a job for the United States Postal Service now, so I could actually afford the truck that I want. Load it up the way I want it. Same truck, just better. I don't know. Not gonna lie, kinda missed the Chevy, but had a lot of good times in that truck. I haven't even done nothing with this truck. I baby it way more than I did the Chevy, so I don't know, gotta stop babying it. Let me know if that helps you out, man. If, if it does, comment back. I'll be really excited for you, brother.